Hey guys, I'm coming at you in another video. Uh, the update of the R. Kelly situation. Okay, so I saw this yesterday on my email. And it is reported that R. Kelly was dropped by the label due to the sex cult accus accusations. <laughs> well, I can't speak this month. Alright, well anyway, this post... Um, the post that I read actually came from Essence, but this is news from yesterday, and I am going to read you guys a little paragraph from The Telegraph. R. Kelly has been dropped by his breaker label following a stream of accusations of sexual abuse of minors. The rapper and Stony Music own RCA record label ended their arrangement on Friday, according to the industry publications. Billboard Magazine and Variety reported that he no longer appears on the roster of artists on the RCA website. The reported split follows decades of allegations of sexual and phys physical abuse by the Grammy-winning singer, which, which were the subject of a new Six-hour television documentary aired earlier this month. Art Kelly's attorney has denied the allegations. They still just keep on denying, denying, denying. RCA and Kelly's representatives have not been commented. Variety Croton, an identi identified source, says Stony Music had decided to dissolve its working relationship with Kelly but that no external announcement will be made. Billboard reported that the musician and the record company had agreed to part ways, citing un unnamed sources. It said Kelly's catalog will remain with RCA. His music is still available on digital retailers and streaming services. RCA came under renewed pressure this month to drop Kelly, best known for his hits, I Believe I Can Fly, and in the wake of a Lifetime documentary in which multiple women, including his ex-wife, made on-camera allegations of emotional, sexual, and physical abuse. Campaigners from the hashtag MuteRKelly pressure group delivered a petition signed by some 217,000 people to Stony headquarters to Stony headquarters in New York City earlier this week asking the record company to drop the musician. Kelly, who is 52 years old, released his last album in 2016. He tweeted earlier this month that a new album was on the way. Okay, y'all, so it looks like karma is making its way on through. What do you guys think about the situation? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Also, be sure to like this video if you want to see more. Subscribe if you like, and I'll catch you guys next time.